Stress and anxiety are clearly closely related to visual snow syndrome. I don't, in my own mind, believe that they are a cause. I do think that if there is significant stress and anxiety, it may reduce your capacity to suppress the symptoms. I also think that for many patients, the presence of the symptoms causes anxiety and even depression. So it becomes interactive and in the past, there is absolutely no doubt in my mind that this was aggravated by the medical profession who told them that it was psychological in origin or it was migraine, but they didn't have anything that they could offer them. So people were being told more or less that they were mad uh, for a symptom that they couldn't help.